Protein-rich smoothies help slow the absorption of food and this reduces the speed at which sugar enters the bloodstream. It also helps you maintain muscle mass which help to regulate blood sugar as well. Welcome everyone. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notification. So, so to make this drink that is very good for you if you are diabetic, the first ingredient we are going to be needing here will be broccoli. And for the broccoli, I'm using frozen broccoli. You can use fresh one, you can use frozen one. Any one you have is very okay. What you will be needing here is about one cup of broccoli. If you are diabetic, you should go for a low carb diet as it helps keep the blood sugar levels in control. And broccoli is one of those vegetables that you will need if you are diabetic because it is very low in glycemic index of 15, which makes it an ideal fit for diabetics. Broccoli has been shown to promote insulin sensitivity and reduce blood sugar levels in people with type 2 diabetes because it's rich in nutrients like vitamin A and vitamin E, low on glycemic index and have lots of fiber, which, which means eating broccoli will help you fill up without significantly raising your blood sugar. Other vegetables you can also add to your diet as a diabetic patient are carrots, broccoli, like we are using here, zucchini, cabbage, spinach, tomato, cucumber, lettuce, all those green leafy vegetables are so good for you. And after broccoli, the next thing we have here is spinach. And for the spinach, I'm using one handful of spinach. If you don't have spinach, you can use kale or any other green leafy vegetable because they are very good for you if you're diabetic. Spinach, spinach is a rich source of fiber which does not digest easily. So spinach does not cause immediate spike in blood sugar levels. Spinach is rich in soluble fiber which is responsible for reducing blood glucose level and control diabetics. Do you know that a cup of raw spinach has only one gram of carbohydrates, which makes this vegetable a diabetic friendly food to add to your diet because it is loaded with antioxidants such as vitamin A and, and this one cup of raw spinach has about 94% of your daily needed vitamin A. And this green leafy vegetable is enriched with heart-friendly nutrients like potassium, folate, and magnesium. And it is a good source of lutein. Lutein is instrumental in preventing thickening of walls of arteries, which helps reducing the risk of strokes and blood pressure. And please make sure to wash your vegetables before you use them. After spinach, the next thing we have here is blueberries. I'm using blueberry if, you, if have you have any of the berries you use, but for me, I'm using blueberries. And for the blueberries, I'm going to be using about one cup of blueberries. I have frozen one, but go with whatever you have, either frozen or fresh one. Blueberries may help your body process glucose more efficiently, and this is because they help improve your insulin sensitivity. And by doing this, it helps you keep your blood sugar levels under control, which then may help to avoid diabetes. Always, always eat your berries. Berries are good. They are super food. That they are the disease-fighting food that you can add to your diet. Start today to eat berry. Anyone you can see within you, eat any of the berries. If you can find all of them, mix all of them in a blender and blend and drink. You are fighting against loss of diseases. And after the fruit and vegetables, we have some protein to add to this drink. And the first protein we have here is pumpkin seed. So continue watching for you to know the measurement I used. Fiber. And diet high in fiber are associated with lower risk of diabetes and better controlled blood sugar level. And these seeds are also rich in omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids. Pumpkin seed provide healthy fat that may help prevent type 2 diabetes and heart disease. Pumpkin, Pumpkin seeds are also a low glycemic food, which means they do not significantly raise your blood sugar levels. Pumpkin seeds are a glycemic index score of 12, make, making them, them an ideal food to add to your diet if you're diabetic and after the pumpkin seed the next thing we have here is sunflower seed which is also a good protein to help you control your sugar level you need healthy protein in your diet in your smoothies so that you'll be able to bring down your sugar level 
if you don't have if you don't have sunflower seeds you can use flax seed sunflower seeds have a role in the reduction of glucose levels and can be used to treat type 2 diabetes because the because bioactive compounds in these seeds are involved in the treatment of insulin resistance or insulin production and after the sunflower seed we also have here half of a lemon to add to this drink because, because this drink is for diabetic patients because you wouldn't want to drink or eat something that will rise your blood sugar level so adding half of a lemon to this drink will definitely make this drink a very delicious and good drink for you to drink if you are diabetic and another ingredient i added here also is cashew nut butter you can use regular cashew nut if that is what you have but i have the cashew nut butter so i'm going to be adding that so keep on watching for you to know the measurement i used for that so after preparing all the ingredients you transfer all the prepared ingredients into the blender and you're going to be blending for the pumpkin seeds i used two tablespoons of the pumpkin seed and then for the sunflower seed i use one huge tablespoon and also for the cashew nut butter i use one huge tablespoon after adding everything the liquid we're using here to make this drink is water because we wouldn't want to add any added sugar to this drink so after adding the liquid you cover and you blend and you have to blend smoothly because this is a smoothie for me i like my drink to be smooth and creamy so if you are like me and you want to have that kind of drink the link of this blender is on the description box it's gonna give you the worth of the money you're going to be spending to get this blender i've been using it for some time now and it has been serving me so good so go there click on it and it will take you to where you can get yours and it's affordable it can also last for you so after blending what next you have to do is to transfer to your cup and you drink just check out the creaminess of this drink high in fiber very good for you to drink and these ingredients in this and all the nutrients in this cup will definitely sink into your system and do the job so this drink is very good for you if you're a man you're a woman you're diabetic this is good for you because because this will help you control your sugar level drinking this in the morning is a very good breakfast that you can have and you are good to go you can even make it on the go this is a very good breakfast smoothie that you can be drinking i have some other recipes on this channel i will link them on the description box so that you go and check other recipes i have made concerning diabetes so guys this is one of the recipes you can be drinking this every other day you can be you know alternating it with other things that you know you're eating to help control your sugar level but this will be a plus to your diet it's gonna help you be able to control your sugar level and also nourish your body generally so guys that's what i have come to share with you in today's video if you find this video helpful please please don't forget to give it a thumbs up share with friends and families and if you are new to this channel and you have not yet subscribed please click on the red subscribe button and also turn on your post notification so that you'll be notified for the next video that will be coming up i appreciate you everyone that always comment on my videos may god continue to bless you i thank you my wonderful subscribers i thank you for those that share my videos may god continue to replenish you in all your hard work in whatever you do may your hands be blessed in jesus name thank you and i will see you very soon in the next video bye bye for now